Bailey. Oh, Bailey, chill out. We know you're bulking. It's all good. You can slow down. You don't gotta eat so fast. <laughs> Bailey's right. bulking. She got me jealous. Look at all this food. <laughs> Rice is bulking too, man. I'm out here struggling. Hey, man, that's not funny, man. That's not funny, bro. That's not funny. I don't get to eat calories like you do. That ain't funny. just got back from a slight little photo shoot that's why I'm wearing this but yeah uh, of course Zeb wants to do that photo shoot when it's no shave November and I'm looking crazy um, Bigfoot is real bro <laughs> we about to make cream spinach all right guys you want to make the most bomb cream spinach get ready for this you ready butter cream cheese spinach extra cheese <gasps> Tablespoons of butter. Now watch that joint melt. Two full bags of spinach. Next step, I'm gonna get your cream cheese. Got little measurements on the side, right? Uh, you see them lines? Blur lines. That's too much steam. But anyway, yeah, there we go. Each serving is an ounce. So we're gonna do one ounce per bag of spinach. Let me see A lot of mozzarella cheese, normally that's what I use, but we're gonna use Mexican cheese because Mexican cheese is good as hell. You want, again, one serving per bag of spinach. It's about right. Give it a nice little mix. <laughs> Sprinkle some of that, or throw a lot on. Right before it's done, give it a nice little mix. Tell me this doesn't want to make you eat spinach. Look at that, look at that creaminess in the cheese. So guys, um, I did two bags. I do two bags at once because obviously when you put all that spinach in there, it needs that room to wilt. So I just do two bags at once. But guys, I made this in like five minutes and it makes spinach taste amazing. So I don't want to hear you. I don't like vegetables, blah, blah, blah. Don't lie. You like cheese. Cheese be good as hell. Don't even lie. People are like, nah, I don't mess with cheese. Nah, you lying, bro. You lying. Anyway, look at that. About to smash. Hey guys, um, I told you I was making four bags of spinach. That's four servings. Pretty much I cut this in quarters, so each bag of spinach is a serving. So you can have it for snacks or um, something that's like a side to your meal. It's not like a full meal in its own. I mean, unless you really want to make it that way, but it's kind of heavy with all the cheese that it has. But if you're on keto, that doesn't matter. It's crucial. But not as crucial as sour cream. What's up guys? Thank you for watching the vlog. I appreciate it. If you're an OG follower, I love you. You already know that. If you're a new follower, hey, I love you too because you're checking out the videos and I really appreciate it. So here, uh, I just want to talk about guys, you don't have to go to the gym every single day for a workout. Um, here we're just doing some field work. Now let me specify, we're not athletes, we're not football players, you know, we're just going out there having fun, doing some drills. Um, it doesn't have to be anything serious. Just go out there, have some fun, burn some calories. It's another way to, uh, hit the gym or, you know, get those gains, get them cuts, whatever you need. Um, so yeah, we're doing some field work. It was super windy. We were going to do a Zeb it, a Zeb edit, uh, but we couldn't due to the uh, wind messing up the gimbal. 
Also in this video, we're going to talk about what foods you can eat when you go out to uh, go out to eat for keto. A lot of people have asked me about that, so we'll touch on that. And yeah, we're also going to hit a basketball edit in three, two, one. <laughs> Show you what you can get while you're on keto chicken lettuce sour cream cheese it's all keto this man don't do keto so you know, i don't i don't do keto because i am not losing weight i'm trying to gain weight <sighs> but anyway we about to smash So we have Red Robin, and uh, this is what you can get on keto. Got that lettuce wrap burger, double pepper jack cheese, bacon, tomato, mayo, and some broccoli. Uh, these these Balkan boys over here, they got their fries and their buns, making me jealous. Um, so yeah, this is how you can eat out on keto. So we got like uh, the chicken breast with some whole grain buns, because you know I'm all about the buns. And we got unlimited sweet potato fries. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's like a what unlimited amount of fries. So I went with the sweet potato fries, and this my guy always copies me, you know, because bro, you know, little bro always copying the big bro. So unlimited amount of sweet potato fries. This is our second round. Probably gonna be our last one because my stomach is bloated as fuck right now. But yeah, man. Watch your language. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But yeah, this but, um, is. I got tons of sweet potato fries right here, guys. Um, you can't see them though, but like they're pretty good. He's eating them. Yeah. Like, can, can I get one, bro? Let me get one. I got you. Damn, you missed, bro. Yo, this they're, they're right here, bro. Oh, my bad. Right? Yeah. I got it. Damn, bro. This is a little bit of a crank. <laughs> All right, guys. So as you can tell from the uh, title of this video, I messed up. Um, I haven't been on keto for like two weeks now. I've been eating carbs, uh, making excuses. So I think one of the main things that I didn't do is I didn't give myself a goal because I was like, oh, I'm not competing. You know, I don't, I don't need to be done by a certain time. You know, I want to be lenient with myself and not too lenient and I'm getting too lenient. So I want to start a little bit of a, it's, it's a better way to get to the road to 155, better way to do the, the whole road there, the journey. So what I'm going to do, guys, it is currently November 26th, Sunday, and it is pretty much one month, no, it's pretty much one month, <laughs> whatever if it didn't focus, uh, it's pretty much one month away from Christmas, um, so my goal is to hopefully get to around 155 by Christmas, I'm about 170 right now, um, and I've been there for a little bit, I haven't been doing my cardio and all that stuff, so what I'm going to do is, for these videos, every day I'm going to take a picture of what my weight is, and um, I'm going to put it in the beginning of the video so you can see my progress, uh, keep myself accountable, and uh, hopefully if you guys are cutting or bulking, whatever you're doing, we can do this together. So I'm going to get back on track. I'm not going to make excuses like, oh, we're human, blah, 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 like whatever. You know, like I'm tightening down. I want to get it done so we can get bulking, get them gains. So let's get it, guys. <laughs> 